you've been through, why you got scars Since you walked through the door, I've been trying to reach you Cause I feel you What's the story to tell, what's the story behind The mountain you're trying to climb Think of her Beauties. Welcome back to the channel, or if you are brand new here and this is the very first time you ever see me, what's up? I am Jen. I share all things health and wellness here on the channel. Anything I do to level up my own life, I share with you guys in hopes to inspire and motivate you to do the same. So if that sounds like your jam, make sure to subscribe before we jump into today's video. Alrighty guys, we have another weekly grocery haul and meal plan video coming at you. We did Walmart drive up, Sam's drive up, Target drive up, and went into Aldi. So we hit up all the same usual suspects to get all the things we need to keep us trucking along on this health journey feed the crew keep us thriving all the things and not just for this week these groceries and dinners will carry us for the next week and a half because we will be flying out to summer smash next thursday so we'll not be doing a grocery haul next week so just got enough stuff to carry us through the week and dinners into the next week which you guys will see the meal plan for all of that i will also be doing a live next wednesday i had planned on doing one this past week but my daughter ended up going into labor and having the baby if you guys follow me on instagram you would have seen that that's why my posting schedule has been a little off but we are going to catch up on all of the things and everything that's been going on in life on that live so if you guys are able to come hang out with me next Wednesday I would love to have you there we can catch up and chat and all of the things but without a ton of gabbing want to see everything we picked up in this week's grocery haul as well as the meal plan just keep watching jumping into Sam's Club first we spent $146 at Sam's we got some goodies we're going to go ahead and dive right in of course repeat purchase blueberries you guys know every single week this is also turned into a repeat purchase the Members mark rotisserie season chicken breast bites fully cooked absolutely delicious macros are 160 calories a serving 22 grams protein perfect if you don't have time to meal prep for lunch through the week or just for a quick easy dinner also same thing you guys know the members mark pulled pork is one of my favorites it is 90 calories a serving 13 grams protein again awesome for a lunch option if you don't have time to meal prep or for a dinner option it makes life quick and easy and you guys know that's what i'm all about staying in that same vein we got the yukon gold mashed potatoes real butter real milk sea salt fully cooked they're delicious macros on these are awesome as well 120 calories a serving five grams protein and again super quick and convenient got some liquid egg whites for meal prep we've been flying through these making the egg bites if you guys missed that meal prep video go check it out i've had a ton of people make them and they absolutely love them you could switch it up i'm actually switching it up this week going to do a different flavor and some different protein in it but same concept gonna be delicious and then we are going to be traveling so I'm gonna just getting different kind of protein bars that we can have on hand better options and a lot of stuff they have on the planes and all of that next week so we'll take some built bars and then we'll take some of these fit crunch I love the texture of these and I'm a huge texture person and they taste awesome as well 16 grams protein there's nine chocolate peanut butter in there and nine chocolate chip cookie dough and they're both delicious mac and cheese cups of course for the little guy and then picked up some more of our favorite just bare lightly breaded chicken strips they are on sale this week so if you guys have these in your Sam's Club definitely scoop them up 17 grams of protein they're delicious quick to throw in the air fryer throw on a salad chicken Caesar salad throwing a wrap anything like that the kids love them so that's a big hit in our house then we got the twin pack of plain bagels for the kids and then i got some of these idaho spuds golden grill hash brown potatoes this huge box they are 70 calories a serving one gram protein per serving as packaged if you prepare them how they say then there are the macros there but i am just going to throw these in my egg bakes and i think they're going to be delicious i'll keep you guys posted on those we've got another easy meal coming in for taco tuesday we've got the angus beef fajitas probably should have picked up two of these bags i thought this was a little bit bigger but a serving is 120 calories 18 grams protein so that's what we'll be doing for taco tuesday this week this is another new find we got the members mark hardwood smoked and seasoned pork burnt ends with barbecue sauce gluten-free there's the macros there 240 calories a serving 27 grams protein so really good macros i'll keep you guys posted on how they are they sound delicious and all the members mark things are a hit for convenience taste everything so i'm sure this will be but i'll keep you guys posted on those and then we got a bag of sweet potatoes so that's all of the goods from sam's now jumping into our tiny little haul at walmart it was only 
30 bucks at Walmart. They were out of stock of one thing, but I'll pick that up at Target, which you'll see in a second. We got some extra calf K cups for the hubby. We got some thin sliced turkey breasts for the kids. My son has been on a hot dog kick over at my sister's house, so I went ahead and picked some up for him. We got some ballpark beef franks and then some hot dog buns for him. They are getting ready to be out of school for summer this week, so having all those easy snacks on hand are a win. And then for a couple dinners this week, I needed some of the Velveeta shreds. Picked up one bag of the Mexican style blend and one bag of the cheddar. Macros for one serving, which is a quarter cup, is 60 calories and five grams protein. And then picked up a Purdue Harvest Land whole young chicken, and it's actually pretty decent size, which I'm glad about. I was hoping that it wasn't going to be a small one. I'm going to be tossing this baby in the crock pot. So excited for that dinner. And then random from Amazon, we got Celsius. Instead of Zevia this week, we went with the Celsius energy drinks because they were on sale. And then on top of that, they had a subscribe and save deal. So I got a really killer deal on this case and I have been liking the Celsius ones lately. So I'll kind of switch back and forth. So we picked those up and I already popped some in the fridge, but that's the goods for Molly World and Sam's. Now let's jump into Target. All right, next up, we've got $55 clocking in at Aldi. And then we have about 90 bucks clocking in at Target. We'll go ahead and dive into Aldi first. They've been out of stock the last few weeks of the sweet and spicy chunk light tuna packs, which you guys know I absolutely love, as does my daughter. And she was like, mom, please score some of those. 80 calories for one pouch, 14 grams protein. Super quick and easy, convenient protein option. And they're delicious. I love throwing them on rice cakes. So I stocked up on a ton of those. We got some more of the multi-grain tortilla chips, gluten-free, organic, all of that jazz. We got some cantaloupe. We love cutting up all the fresh fruit this time of year. Cantaloupe and watermelon are our jams. These are new. You guys know I love a good veggie blend that is frozen and you could toss in a skillet and cook and be ready to go in just a few minutes. This is a German cabbage blend, which looks delicious. Throw some protein with it. You'll be good to go. 70 calories for one serving, two grams protein. So I'll keep you guys posted on how I like that. Picked up some of their kosher dill spares. I swear these are like the best pickles ever. They're so crispy and fresh and delicious. I love them. Got some zucchini for Sunday night's dinner. Got some extra virgin olive oil. I usually get the avocado oil spray, but they didn't have any, so just went ahead and grabbed that. And then you guys know, if you've been around for a hot minute, these cookie thins are my jam. Chocolate chip and key lime are my top two flavors. Hubby was in the store with me, and he likes the lemon, so he threw those in cart. 130 calories a serving. I like to have a serving of these with a protein shake at the end of the night. Absolutely delicious. Got a couple boxes of ramen noodles for the kids because it's summertime and that's super quick and easy for them to snack on. Nieces, nephews, grandbabies, little guy, all of that. So picked up two boxes of those. Got more apples. Hubby, of course, was with me and he is the apple king and he saw these babies and they looked absolutely delicious. So he scored a few of those. Got some bananas that are nice and green. So hopefully they will be eaten before they go bad because we have not been batting a thousand with bananas lately. And then got some of the hash brown patties. If you guys caught the last meal prep video where I showed the egg bake and just throw these hash browns in the bottom, I actually got those other hash browns from Sam's too. So we'll just be swapping back and forth, but they don't always carry these in Aldi. So when I see them, I just go ahead and grab one up. Now diving into the Target goodies, picked up two packs of the farm to family ground turkey breast. This one's 96% lean. This one's 93% lean. I like to mix those together. Got some more of the Good and Gather all natural turkey sausage. You guys know I love to meal prep with this because it's delicious and the macros are on point. Picked up some more of the True Fruit chocolate covered strawberries, 90 calories a serving and they are 10 out of 10 delicious. Got some Fair Life milk two containers of the Good Culture Cottage Cheese, more of the Zero Sugar Sodas. We're on a deal again this week for 40% off if you bought three of them, which is a killer deal because you guys know these are astronomical prices for these sodas. So we got two of the ginger ale and one of the root beer. That's just been our jam lately. Got some chunky guacamole and then got some Good and Gather mild sweet onion salsa, 10 calories a serving and this stuff is absolutely delicious. And then two things of the cooked shrimp with cocktail sauce. These are awesome macros and then delicious. I really love the ones that they have at Aldi, but again, they're hit or miss at Aldi. So they've been out of stock for weeks now. So we just picked some up at Target. And then last from Target, we got some Dave's English muffins. So that's all the goodies from Target. 
and Aldi. Now we'll go ahead and jump into the meal plan. All right, beauty, so here's what we're working with for the meal plan for the next week and a half, because like I said, we'll be heading out, we'll be flying out next Thursday, so we have this week's meal plan as well as the first half of the week next week. So Monday we'll be going in with Brenner because breakfast for dinner is always a hit and easy, and you guys already know at this point that's what I'm all about, anything easy and convenient, right? Tuesday we'll be going in with the pork burnt ends with the Yukon Gold mashed potatoes and corn on the cob. Wednesday we will be having leftovers. Thursday we'll be going in with the shrimp skewers that we got from Aldi last week. We still have some in the freezer with sweet potato and veg. Friday, super easy, we'll be making up some of that Members Mark Rotisserie chicken to throw on a salad. Saturday we will be doing sweet potato hash with that turkey from Target, which you guys know is one of my favorite meals and I haven't made it in forever and it makes absolutely incredible leftovers and it's really easy to throw together. Sunday, we will be throwing that chicken in the crock pot with the mashed potatoes. Now, Saturday and Sunday, those dinners may switch up because we'll be helping my sister and brother-in-law move. And so you never know if we end up like moving, working late into the night because you guys know, hello, moving, right? So I may end up switching some of those dinners up into other nights of the week. And then next week, before we go out of town, on Monday, we'll be having leftovers of all the stuff that we've had the previous week. We'll be doing the steak fajitas for Taco Tuesday. And then Wednesday, we'll be clearing out any leftovers just so we don't have a ton of stuff left in the fridge and then we'll be flying out on Thursday we'll be in St. Louis Friday and Saturday and then we'll fly home on Sunday so that's all the dinners for the next week and a half you guys of course let me know what you guys are loving and throwing in your dinner rotation pop them down below love to get ideas from you guys as well as everybody else so we can keep it fun and spicy in the kitchen hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up that definitely helps me out and lets me know to keep these videos coming for you guys. If you aren't subscribed, make sure to do that before you leave. I hope you guys are out there absolutely crushing it at life. And I will catch y'all in the next video.